What is up, y'all? Welcome to Combo Breaker 2022 right here in Schaumburg, Illinois. And man, you are in for a treat today. We got oh, yes. some Vampire Savior here on Vampire Arcadia. What's good, y'all? I'm Hagare over here. Along uh, with my co-commentator. I'm Tank Top Typhoon. How's it going, Hagare? It is swell, man. It is so good to be back. Oh, yeah, man. After all this time, right? it has been... Everybody's here, this tournament. It's yeah. amazing. These pools are stacked. Yeah. Today we're starting with Pool G right now. Yeah. Oh, man. I mean, all of these pools, right? All of these pools. This pool in particular is, you know, we we running out the <laughs> gate right here on this one, man. For real. This is, uh, we got Typhus. He got mm -hmm. third at Frosty uh, this year. We have Minimaw in this bracket. Yeah. We yep. have K-Jock in this bracket. And someone who I didn't expect to show up, Dyer, is here. Yeah, today right. Bracket. Dyer, yeah. West Coast represent. Oh, it is going to be, it's going to be wild. I think for, we have Minimaw and K-Jock on the bottom. And I okay. believe it's Dyer and Typhus on the top half of the bracket oh, today. Okay, so. okay, okay. Oh, and I believe Miller 2B is also in the oh, bracket yo, too. Oh, that's so. right. Yo, Miller, oh man, strong fish player. Um, but yeah, I mean, I hope all of y'all out there are ready some, for some fast and furious action here. Uh, for those of you who know, you know what's coming. You know how Vampire Savior is. For those of you who are new to the game, yeah, I mean, this is like the granddaddy of anime Marvel games, right? Uh, fast pace, lots of action, lots of offensive action, but also a very active defensive game. So, yeah, I mean, it's one of my favorite games, for show. I... I love I love this game. Yeah. It is the fastest game that I still have ever played. Uh, with the defense having the tech hits, mm -hmm. just everything. You're mm -hmm. always doing something every second in that game. Yeah, and it it's a time saver for a reason, you know. Oh yeah, for <laughs> sure. Yeah, yeah. They always run in Vampire Savior. You know. Oh shoot. You know. Our schedule's running behind. Let, let's put on VSAV, right? Yeah. That's um, what, we actually have Count the Money and Strange Brew coming up. Uh, Count the Money is from Columbus. Mm -hmm. Wolf player, of course, part of the Wolf Pack. Yo, shout out to the Wolf oh, Pack. Oh. <laughs> and we got Strange Brew on the right from the Cincinnati scene. He's, uh, I believe he is a Dimitri player. And they look, Ooh. I'm assuming they're testing their buttons. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, he, quick button check, quick button check. Um, but, yeah, as you can see there in the background, um, you can see the PVMs over in the back corner. Um, yeah, shout outs to all of our Artist Alley vendors over there too. Um, but yeah, you know, we, we're here bright and early, you know. Normally we stalk in the night, but today we rising and shining, so. Especially after last night's Real Vampire Hour. Yo, sure. that, was, that was so fun. Uh, oh. That was so fun. Oh, but we right here up oh, in sorry. it. Strange Brew plays Raptor, my bad. Oh, okay. I totally okay. forgot he switched to Zabel. Pick a top tier. Yep, smart move. Pick the zookeeper if you can't pick the zoo. <laughs> One, ooh, ooh. Yo, trying to dunk on him. <laughs> the anti air dunk would have been great. Okay, okay. Right. okay. First game going to count the money. You just missed the beginning of there real quick, but mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that was. Um, but yeah, I mean, both of these characters, right? Um, very fast, very fast. Wolf. One of the fastest walk speeds in any game, but definitely in this game. Yes. <laughs> and then Zabble, man, those those IEDs, those instant air dashes, they come at you fast and furious. So fast that Wolf can just walk right under those fireballs. <laughs> <laughs> yup, yup, yup. Oh, nice. Put the drill real quick. All right. Oh, first PSV scanning of the nice. day. A nice pickup there. Just getting the up down real quick with the pattern. Mm -hmm. Back throw. Throw into the corner. Oh, nice poke out. All right. Ooh. Ooh, doesn't go for the whip pursuit afterwards. Knockdown. Activity, and there we go. Bat down. Pursuit takes it. Nice throw. With that dash fierce, you've got to try to throw that because they're going to be command grabbing you ASAP. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, one, two, three, four. Uh oh, nice okay. pickup. Yeah, but I like yes. that pattern though, yo. Yeah, from, from the air, like that is a very hard pattern to land. Mm hmm. Oh, nice. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh, wow. Oh. Hard dark force. Wow, yo. Oh, and then we going in, we going this in. Watch out. Oh, okay. Nice. Back throw in the corner. All right. Strange Brew really trying to get this bat down. Um, got a lot of white light. Oh, no. Is that going to be oh, it? Oh, okay. No pursuit. Still alive. Oh, oh okay. that'll do it. Course. Yeah, Strange Brew missed a few anti airs there. Definitely could have brought it back a little bit with that. But the slide was a great great way to get out of that situation every yeah, time. Yeah, no, he was, 100%. He's trying to feel less of the pressure. And if you can slide right under that jump over, it makes mm -hmm. it so much easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely, yeah, that's uh, one of uh, zombie strengths, right? Um, you know, the, the crawl walk, uh, like uh, Guile and SF5, yep. that's where it came from, uh, oh, yeah. from Zabble right there. 
Except this one gets this guy out of command throws. Uh, <laughs> Zabel, Zabel gets it all, you know. I, I can't talk too much. You know, <laughs> Wolf ain't, you know, he ain't hurting too bad. Oh, absolutely not. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, when, when it comes to top tier, Zabel is definitely one of the toppest of the top. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, you know, we're always jealous of what we can't have. You know? Yeah, of course, of course. The grass <laughs> is always greener, right? <laughs> exactly. Mm hmm but uh, Count the Money from Columbus, he loves to do Dark Force combos. That's why every walk of oh. Dark Force, I was like, okay, uh, okay. Okay, I see, I see. He, he's a big fan of the unblockable setups. He's got quite a few that he's been uh, showing. He's doing, uh, he found a new one with TK Dark Force uh, Beast Cannon over and over again. You oh. can do that and they can't get out of the block string. And it just seems to, if you do it quick enough, you get the overhead and the low, so you get the unblockable. Word. Yes, Yo, nothing. okay, I gotta get him to show me that. He has been. Man, I, I, really, I really need to work on my TK Beast Cannons. I was trying to do that last night. Um, but yeah, man, it's, it's such a powerful tool. Such a powerful tool. One that I, honestly, I always forget to use. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 100. Wolf uh, but, is so fast, so good, you know? Mm -hmm, yeah, I mean, he's got he's got a lot on his plate, right? Exactly. Um, but yeah, oh, okay. Looks like we got Miller 2B versus Velvet Thunder. So yeah, we're going to get some fish versus that. Look at that shirt. Oh, nice. The, the Hosokawa Sasquatch shirt. So shout out to Hosokawa over there in Japan. That is such a good Sasquatch shirt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, are we going right? Yeah, we're going right into it. All right. And with this matchup, Sasquatch, of course, has the benefit of the Dark Force going through the bubble. That's mm -hmm. the biggest thing. But if you watch somebody like Bo play against some of the top Sasquatch players, it doesn't matter. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Definitely has all kinds of tricks and trades to make that work for him. And uh, yeah, I mean, fish. He knows where his bubble. We, yeah, there it is right nice. there. He's getting a little cheeky with it doing it in neutral. But um, yeah, that bubble is unblockable. And if you get caught in it, you get into a capture state. And you can get comboed right back in. Oh, rolled into it. Are we going to see it? As you're it? saying yeah. it. Oh, just go. goes for the sweep. Nice. Was a little too far. Just want to make sure he got mm -hmm. something. Yeah, I didn't have any meter to, to keep the loop going. Not hurting too much for life. So might as well go for the least risk. Mm -hmm. risk. Yeah, yeah. Keep it safe, right? Ooh. Oh, we're going to get There we go, yeah. Dark Force right through that bubble. Didn't get caught in it. Nice. Oh, oh no. Very nicely played by Miller. Yeah. Throw. Ooh, got the... Actually, one on the other side. Oh, right over the ice tower. Let's see. Right. Oh, trying to apply some pressure, but... No. There we go. Oh, okay, there we go. Nice, nice anti-air option select there from Miller. And, um, yeah, uh, Miller is also another um, kind of Midwest local person, right? Yes, I believe from the Michigan scene, yeah. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. uh, he has been playing a lot online. I know oh, yeah, he's been grinding. He, he has been really good the last few times. I think at Frosty, he, uh, he ended up, I think, only losing to Ethan towards the end there. Oh, but wow. He, uh, okay. he was the finals in our pool. Nice, nice block, nice tech. Oh, got him with that oh. anti-air. Oh, no, don't oh. roll forward against fish. Yeah, got yeah, definitely. Ooh. Oh, okay, didn't get the bubble. All good. All oh, the double trades for all that life. But yeah, I mean, you can't count Sasquatch out, right? Like, if any character can make a comeback, man, it's definitely Sasquatch. Exactly, just three high lows, where'd you go? Okay, oh, oh, what are we? Oh, no. Oh, okay, I'm not... I'm not sure if that was a controller situation or just, yeah, you know, <laughs> keeping it down back. You know what? They're, uh, they're playing it on, so yeah, all right. Yeah, so, uh, <laughs> let's do it. Yes. Nice. All right. Oh, okay. Ooh, that Jumps was over it. Very nice. Nice side switch over there. All right. Oh, yeah, keep the stop. Yeah, throw up that stop sign. Oh, no. Goes no right into allowed. the gas. Oh, nice. Just hit him out real quick. Go for the flip. All right. Take throw down. Oh, oh, and again. Nice. Here they Yeah, very nice. All yeah. you gotta do is hit fish to get rid of that bubble. Exactly, exactly. Easier said than done. <laughs> 100%. <laughs> oh. oh, good stuff from Miller. Taking it 2 0 over Velvet Thunder. Uh, shout out to Velvet Thunder, one of my, my locals over in NorCal. Um, not originally from there, I moved there pretty recently. Uh, one of the homies of uh, Bang, Bang Lele. Yes. Or uh, Internet Slime, Internet Slime now. Uh, but yeah, good stuff, good stuff. Oh, it looks like we got uh, one of Chicago's finest, Typhus, over here. Typhus is coming up. It looks like I believe he is playing the winner of Alex versus Geezer, so I'm not sure who won that. Oh, uh, okay. Coming up, okay. But. Uh, are you familiar nice. with uh, Geezer? Geezer? Okay, we got Geezer versus Typhus. Nice. Uh, are, are you familiar with Geezer at all? Not 
I can't say so. Okay, okay, no problem, but no problem. We'll see, we'll see uh, what character he picks. Uh, Typhus, of course, um, one of our best Felicia players. Yes, and it is. we have so many new players this time. Right, yo, the, the scene has been blowing up, you know, especially during this pandemic era. You know, people are looking for kind of, you know, games with uh, rollback, you know, going to fight Kate and stuff. Yep. And man, um, yeah. So actually, you know what? Shout out to Typhus uh, for being one of the people who helped foster that community, you know, help uh, people grow and uh, run into Vampire Savior Discord. Of course, of course. And then we uh, we also have a, just a new game coming out soon. To exactly. Be able to get even CFC. More into it. Yeah, definitely. Uh, ca you can catch the Capcom Fighting Collection exhibition later today. Uh, I can't remember what channel it's on, but um, yeah, it'll be it'll be fun to see. Oh, uh, yeah. see people's reaction and it's, it'll be cool because I haven't really played a lot of Vampire State or Darkstalkers 1 yeah Vampire Hunter yeah <laughs> Van oh no no that's two Vampire Hunter is the second one but the very first Darkstalkers oh okay that, gotcha. that was actually my first inter introduction to this series um back in Japan when I was a kid the uh, there's a convenience store like basically less than a minute's walk from where I was staying and then I would always go over there they had uh, arcades up in the convenience store and they had Darkstalkers and Fatal Fury. So, yeah, oh. I would just play Darkstalkers all the time. I was like, yo, this game looks sick. Like, all these monsters and stuff, you know? Trying to figure out how to do DP motions. <laughs> uh, yeah, and failing back then. Um, that's but, how it goes when you're a kid, you know? <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, yeah. That's amazing. That I'm I'm very jealous of that. That is, that is yeah, really it was cool. definitely um, a good experience. And, um, yeah, the character I picked on there... Like, I, you know, I was going around and stuff, but the one that I stuck with was Wolf. Of course. And that, that's why I'm a Wolf player today. That's <laughs> that's a good pick always. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, not not too shabby. Not too shabby. And I always, I just love how cool he looks, to be honest. I yep, just think yep. he is a dope character in every way. Yeah, yeah. Uh, one of the reasons I picked him is because, you know, he didn't really have DPs that he needed. He just had, you know, fireball motion. So you I was like, I can do that. I can do that. And he's flying around on the screen. <laughs> I was like, that's pretty cool. I can just fly wherever I want. This is great. Mm -hmm. Playing like Magneto over here. Yep, yep. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, with the uh, with the climb razor, you know, you just gotta do the up down. There's your, there's yeah, your yeah, 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 yeah. I, I don't know. I don't know if he had it uh, in the first one. Again, like I don't. I don't know too much about the game, so you know, looking forward to you know revisiting it. Um, but right now we here with a vampire savior and oh shout shout outs to YGS Yeti Ghetto Slang over there in the background. There he is. Mm hmm. Uh, he will also be on the mic later on today. So yeah, for those of you who don't know, yeah, yeah, you definitely gotta see this guy on the mic, man. For sure. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Even if you can go back and watch the real vampire hours. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Had some had some good time with him when I was on there too. And all, of course, all the community nights that these guys are running every Tuesday. Mm -hmm. uh, Luke and Kyle are usually on there doing commentary sometimes, and then we have um, those exhibitions as well that Luke does a lot of yep, commentary yep. for. Yeah, Exhibitions, Makai Monthly, um, yeah, right here on Vampire Arcadia. Lots of beautiful V-Sav to be seen. But here we go, once again, another Sasquatch. And here comes Typhus right out the gate with a big combo and the corner control. Oh, nice, but nice okay, jump yeah, to get out. Get that knockdown real quick and just jump. Ooh! Big cat combo. Oh, tried to okay. OS, but they're a little too early, or a little too late. Mm -hmm. Yeah, geese are mashing up. Good combo. Oh yeah, and here this is exactly what we were talking about with Sass, right? Like Oh, okay. Oh, dang, nice chicken block. Yeah, I wonder if he was trying to go for a guard cancel there and it just uh, did it too early or something. Um but yeah, here we go. Tyce is uh, taking full advantage of that and pushing Geese to the corner again. Oh no. Ooh. Oh yeah, mm -mm. yeah. No, no short hopping for you. I got that cat claw. That's a very rough spot, especially you, you pretty much have to tech hit that first hit. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That lo that loop is it's really frustrating because <laughs> you know the command grab is coming right after that, right? It's like, what do I do? Jump off? Oh, nope, 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 nope. Put right up my right up my leg. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh nice. So here we go. Ooh, yeah. nice jab combo from Typhus. And yeah, and that, that's one of the things uh, for Felicia that you can really see like the hallmark of a good Felicia is how good are their dash combos. You know, if they can get those off, man, you know, shout out to Aileris. <laughs> man, of course. He, he doesn't miss. <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's yeah. very good. Definitely yeah. why he's one of the best in the Oh, US. yeah. Yeah, definitely uh, my favorite. Yes. <laughs> um, but here we go. Um, yeah, had a little fight back, back there. there. 
Oh, oh very nice, yo. Nice. Combo into the super. Very nice. Again, and that'll do it. Type is taking that 2-0 with the greatest of ease. That is Felicia for you. Two yeah. hits in the corner into super into ES Sonic Spin. Boom, that's your whole health. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. This yeah. character is, he, she's got mad damage. Yeah, I mean, she's got damage. What she has more of, though, is anti-airs. She has every anti-air in the book. And in a game like this, where uh, jumping is a very strong tool, it's a very nice thing to have. Yes. You know? And having the wall jump just mm -hmm. to be able to chicken block even when you try to do an air to air, it's oh yeah, so yeah. So a lot of those corner traps and corner pressure stuff, you know, she has like a kind of like Chun Li and claw, right? Where she can climb up on the wall, but she could cling on it too. <laughs> so like she doesn't ha immediately have to jump off. She could just cling there, wait for you to like try to anti air and then jump off. And yeah, man. It, you know, really good tools, really good tools that character. As we've been seeing a lot of fish, you know, just that's one of the easiest ways to get out of the bubble. Just cling there and hope that they don't try to air-to-air -air you yep, or try yep. to be tricky with it. It's yeah. Felicia is such a good, fun character. And it looks like we've got Mini Maw coming up right now. Ooh, okay, yeah, yeah. Another one of the Wolfpack versus Meaty. Uh, another uh, SoCal boy uh, coming from the, the land of uh, Rotanabor. Shout-outs to oh. Rotanabor. And... Um, I know uh, Game Realms is their arcade down there uh, where they play, or a uh, game store, I should say, gotcha. where they all play and congregate. Um, but yeah, I want to say he plays fish, if I remember right. Oh yeah, I hear the I hear the waves, I hear the waves. Um, so I believe it is a fish player. We'll see. The spirit of One Eyed Willie is living on in these tournaments. Oh yeah, <laughs> all 100%. these fish players. Yeah, 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 man. Yesterday, oh, uh, during in the casuals and uh, yesterday during the real vampire hours. There was like one moment where it was like all the fish players like in a row. It was like five or six fish and you know, we were under the sea over there. Every time we have our monthly, uh, like the Cincy Clash last month, it was like, I think, majority Oh, but it's not fish, it's not fish. My bad, my bad, that's right. Yeah, it's a Felicia player, so yo. Yeah, it's raining cats and dogs. You know, we got the water, but it's cats and dogs. Of course, Mini Moth definitely on this matchup, playing against Ailers all the time. Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, uh, big ooh, very nice confirmation from Mini Moth. I like the pattern there, just to make sure they got the pickup from that far. Yeah, yeah, he's really good at recognizing that and going for that 6-6 six, six pattern instead. Yep. So much easier when you have to do those long-range beast cannons, too, because mm -hmm. that diagonal sometimes just miss on you. 100%, 100%. Oh, nice pressure go. in the corner. Dark Force ooh, with Dark Force. Oh, but watch out, you gotta get the activate. Oh, ESP scanner? Yup. Yeah, yeah nice punish right there. With pursuit? Yep. Yeah. So he's been telling me about this. He has been using, specifically against Felicia, the medium kick OS instead of the heavy kick OS. Because oh, okay. It's easier for her to just hold up back and get out of the, the OS just because of how fast her jump is. Oh, okay. But also, it stops anything like if you go on Cat Scratch. You can yeah. do that one and it's much better instead of the heavy kick so you get it way faster. Yeah, oh, interesting, interesting. Yeah, I've been exploring that too. Um, yeah, there's sometimes where, yeah, the, the heavy kick, QB is one of those two. Yes. Um, because she, if, she, if she crouches and you miss it, she gets a big punish. I mean, she can cr actually, she can crouch under the a medium kick too, but uh, yeah, it's better to uh, pick her. Oh, pick up right here. Nice, nice pick up. very nice pick up right here. Mini Maw right. is starting off great today. Mm -hmm. Those cannons. All right, blocking them all. Blocks. Very nice, but yeah, gotta expect the throw afterwards. Got the white life, and that'll do it. Mini Maw. That fast bat, uh, take it, send in mini maw or <laughs> mini midi. <laughs> and we got a midi maw midi battle maw? right here, yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, midi going to the losers bracket, um, but good stuff. Oh, and okay. looks like uh, mini maw is staying on. All right, cool, cool. Um, so I believe, oh, is this mop? I want to say this is mop, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. And mop was playing in the uh, the exhibition last yeah, night, yeah, yeah, yeah. I believe they were. I'm going to say they were also playing fish, but that's always my assumption right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when in doubt, you know, choose an animal, right? The, that's the, the, you know, whenever we talk to beginners for this game, you know, they're like, oh, I don't know what character to play. They're like, when in doubt, you know, choose an animal, go to the zoo. You, can, you can't do wrong there. One yeah. of the animals will get you far. Exactly. Just never pick, uh, 
Just don't pick the mummy. As long as you don't pick uh, the mummy. Yeah, the mummy, yeah. I mean, you know, if you're about that life, no more power to you. But yeah, it's a little rough. A little rough. Oh, mob. I had another Felicia player. Another, actually, yeah, another fish. Nope, no, they're actually Felicia. Yeah, yeah. Fish Felicia, you know, so close. Yeah, oh, yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> Meanwhile, just going through Felicia Rollin, I guess, right now. Yeah, yeah, uh huh. Nice using that medium kick to keep Felicia locked down. Oh, nice. Unblockable. Yeah, nice guard break right there. Right into the throw in the corner to steal that bat. Oh, there we go. That's what we were talking about with those anti airs. Um, yeah, Felicia 5 LK. Awesome. And she can spam it too. So, like, if, you know, that anti air will definitely hit you if you, you know, if you, if you expect it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And especially against Wolf with how fast his jump is, it's like one of the best interrupts for it. It's exactly, so good. Exactly. Exactly. Back throw. Here we go. Oh, nice. Are we going to? Yeah. Bat down. Good stuff on MLP. Oh, no. Hit my last hit there on the Beast Cannon. All right. There's the throw. With okay. pursuit. Ooh. Oh. Tried to do the deep kicking deep. Oh, wow. Good block. That was on the other side. Very nicely done. Okay. Oh, I, I like that Dark Force. Yeah, knew that they were in a bad situation, put themselves in a bad situation. Just man, Dark Force, but there we go. Picking it up again with the ESBC. That was such a good pattern there at the end, too. But that is, yeah, man. That is such a risk with Felicia doing that Dark Force. Mm -hmm. If you cannot get that, at least get them to block in the air that Kitty Helper so you yeah. can deactivate a little bit more safely. But he got a, a, a very good safety activation there, and that saved him. Yeah, yeah. That, that is one of the things about Dark Force in this game. Every character has a Dark Force. You know, it's kind of like a V-Trigger or something where everybody has a different one. Um, but yeah, you have to deactivate it because if you don't and you let that timer run out, you know, your your taunt that you do after it takes forever and you're easily punishable. Yes, and that's the main thing that a lot of people see, you know, because it's, it's a good way to do anti-grab tech. So. Exactly. You get some startup invo on it. So yeah, it's very nice. Oh, look at these patterns for me to... Got the cross up at the end there. Oh, nice back there. Right, the nice other throw. corner. Okay, a little bit too early on the Oki, so Mop gets the corner. Ooh, tries to go for that OS of her own. Oh, just jumping in. All right, nice block. Oh, oh. oh. The last two. I saw they tech hit the, the move before. I wonder if they're trying to tech it again. And um, it's very good if you can do it, but also very dangerous too. Yes, you're just risking sticking a finger right into that beast cannon. Mm -hmm, yeah, yeah, you're sticking your hand into the blender. You don't want to do that. Oh, jumped in, but it doesn't get you Oh, oh. I think that's what, it happened again. Yep. Uh, yeah. Oh, no. And he's switching Ooh, up the pattern to yeah, change the timing. To, yep, to beat the tech. Yes. Do that up diagonal, use mm -hmm. a little bit more time, but good stuff to Mini Maw. Yeah, yeah. Um, a, a quick uh, two advancements in the bracket, so... Yeah, and Mini Maw looking pretty good to qualify out of pools. He has been looking solid. He has won the last few community nights for yeah. us every Tuesday, and um, he's just been doing great. I know right now his neck isn't doing so great, but... <laughs> oh, I heard, I heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I got Count the Money helping him down, but we have a great match sitting down right now. This Ooh, me. yo, look, yo, okay. Oh, I love that jacket. That's a nice yo, good jacket. Yeah, man. I mean, Dyer always comes to these tournaments like looking real fresh, real <laughs> fresh, you know. He doesn't come out to too many, but Combo Breaker is definitely one of the ones that he always tries to make it out to. So I, I'm really glad that he was able to come out. One of one of my favorite players, like, just to watch, uh, you know, any character. His and Lilith play is amazing. Immaculate. I he, uh, when did he, he won a combo breaker a while back, I believe. Yeah, yeah, it one of the earlier ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and then, oh, I mean, he's, every time he enters, he pretty much makes top eight at least. Yes, and he is, uh, he's one of those lo uh, loser bracket power-ups, too. Oh, man, 100%, yeah. Just like, uh, Ailer is sitting right here. Yeah, you know? Ailer is, oh, man, that's, <laughs> yeah. It, it's cool sending him to the loser's bracket, but, man, if you got to face him in there, oof, oof. At least 10 times harder. But we got Miller 2B Fish versus Dyer. Lilith. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Start. So, yeah. Um, yeah, Miller was doing a lot of uh, bubbles in neutral in the last match. So, I'm wondering if we're going to see that again this time. 
Um, I, I would like, I would expect that he might save it a little bit to, you know, send it to the corner first. Um, and get that loop down because Lula doesn't have too many options to get out. Uh, she does have a guard cancel DP, which is very nice, and then the super jump. Um, but outside of that, I mean, that's more than some people. You know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that guard cancel DP is going to be the main thing if the fish tries to apply pressure after the bubble. Exactly. You just want to, you can hit the fish, oh, bubble's no. gone. Okay, yeah. Didn't get the speed to finish the combo, so yeah, Dyer's still alive. And yeah, Miller looking really good right now. Definitely got a little bit of a sizable lead right now, but three bars for... Ooh, good ooh. block on the way up. Yeah, don't want to press the button on the way up against up against Charging Fish. They uh -oh, will totally but yeah, we get... Yeah, Dyer so good at connecting those LI combos. Man. Oh, such big damage. Yeah. yeah. Taking the lead for that, actually. Mm -hmm. Drop that ES. Oh, and here we go, yeah. Long chain in the air. And yeah, Dyer's definitely one of those players that, um, you know, takes a slow early on, sees what their habits are, and then exploit the heck out of them. Oh, he is, he is definitely on another level when it comes to this game. He oh, 100%. So yeah, solid. yeah. Yeah, one, one, one of the... Ooh, very nice right there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Nice. That trade for Yeah, Miller, Miller, Miller's like, I'll take that trade. Uh, I'll trade with a high any day. Oh, four throw? Oh, okay. nice, nice bait. bait. Nice bait. Miller looking to take down this bat, but Dyer's just not letting it happen. Just make it as frustrating as possible to take this bat. Oh no. All right, yeah. everyone's slowing down real quick. Nice anti-air from Dyer. You know, Dyer has, has a full bat ahead of him. You know, not, not trying to take too many risks. Okay, but finally gets that bat. Yes, the so time is running out for Miller. Definitely has to make some moves, but... Dyer knows that and he's just backing off, you know, playing really safe, not over committing or anything. Oh, okay, yeah, here we go. That'll do it. Yep, the ES fireball and some more pressure just catched him moving. But yeah, that was that's gonna be a hard situation. He had five bars, he was gonna probably do that until he chipped him out. Yep, yep. Pretty much all he could do there is tech kit and or try to do fish's guard cancel, which maybe, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know. Not as good of one as uh as a as a Lilith or any yeah, other DP character, sure, but Nice move there to no, pressure. Nice block from Dyer. Okay, get that cross. And man, that jumping HP from Lilith, so good, so good. That spinning wheel of doom. Super jump into that super big cross. Oh, okay. I see does that it, Does it get the punish? And yeah, Dyer was ready. Like, if you drop this, I'm yes. ready. It's definitely one of those things you see from the Nietzsche players as well, where they like to throw the fireball and just guard cancel and then they land. Mm -hmm. that was so oh, actually, Dark Force. Right. Dark Force is active. Oh, okay, throwing out the bubble, but man, that Dyer super jumps jump. over it and you know, out safely. And that was two meters coming from Miller 2B. And that's one of the things about this, right? Sometimes it's not about the life that he has, it's about the meter he's gained. Because, you know, if, if he gets one hit and you're in the corner in that bubble loop, that's it. That's correct. Yeah. Um, but nice, nice uh, call out right there with that full screen wave. The Baja Blaster, right? <laughs> Trying to fight back at least a little bit here. Mm -hmm. Build oh. some meter, but like you said, all it takes is one knockdown with some meter. If you can get that mix up. Very close to the chip range right now, but nice. Dash underneath. Oh, okay, gets in there. Oh, but that'll do it. So Dyer just, you know, playing very patiently, very methodically, right? Not over committing. Um, I mean, if Dyer smells blood, though, oh man, he can he rush you down? Oh my god! <laughs> man, Lilith rush down is so scary. And look at that shirt. Oh, look nice. at that jacket. Super <laughs> clean, super clean. Very nice, very nice. Oh, oh, yo, we got the Sasquatch. We got the, the Sasquatch eating the banana, yo. <laughs> Rumble in the jungle. What a fork! Oh, shout out to Yeti Ghetto slang, of course. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Nice. That health. Yeah, keeping that health on. Oh yeah, the poster by Dreamin. Uh, shout outs to Dreamin, by the way. Um, you can see it waving in the background. Next time we get on to the commentators, we, we could give you a, a, a little look at the artwork that was commissioned. Uh, Typhus commissioned Dreamin. Oh. <laughs> Very nice. Oh. Woo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. No oh, man, yeah. Why oh, no. Why YGS? All, always acting up. Yep. Love him, man. Like, it's, it's been so nice to see him again in person, you know. We've been doing a, a few of the community nights and exhibitions and stuff, commentating all over Discord. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Don't throw the crab. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. He threw the banana up there? Yep, yep. Oh, my God. Yeah, Mario Kart. <laughs> 
All right, we got K-Doc sitting down, it looks like, right now. All right, so yeah, K-Doc, a very, very strong Lele player. One of the, the oldest folks in the NA community yes. playing this game. Introduced uh, Vampire Savior to a lot of folks, I believe, to the VMP crew themselves, yep. too. Yes, he uh, he is pretty much one of the like first starters of playing this game and just mm. really, like... Opening you up to America, you know? Yeah, for sure, for sure. One of those. Also, uh, a retro techie head right there. Some of those PVMs and super guns and misters and all that stuff in the back. Uh, generously, um, yeah, brought by KJ. I mean, he didn't bring the PVMs on the plane with him. <laughs> um, but he has been known to, you know, I mean, I've seen his, like, he takes pictures of his place. And he's got, like, eight. At one point, he had, like, eight or nine PVMs or yes. something. Uh, all shapes and sizes. There's that stick, of course. Oh, the, the beautiful sticks. And shout outs to Greg Sports on the shirt <laughs> right there. I believe he's lost this stick once and somebody actually found it. Oh, yeah, it he randomly. found it. He yeah. found it. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. I remember I saw him. He posted up a, a tweet uh, asking about it. So funny, but good stuff. Uh, K Jock, of course, the Lele. All and right. We got Luminati playing oh, fish. Okay, that's Luminati. All right, all right, cool. You said K-Jock, one of the oldest GPTO players mm -hmm. way back in the day. Just grinding every random game, Cyberbots, anything. Oh, yeah, animals. man. Yeah, You want to play some Cyberbots on CSC? Yeah, definitely. Yes. Take them out. Oh, yes. my gosh. Ooh. That last hit sucked him back in. Yeah, yeah. If you hit him with the pendulum as it swings backwards, yeah, it, it gets that, you know, backwards push effect. Backing them right into there. So very good stuff for K-Jock. Definitely one of the ones who knows how to use the pendulum to full effect. Yes. Oh, gets trade, but oh, okay. K Jock taking the bat. Yeah, we'll take that. Every day of the week, let's see. Oh, nice tech. Keep him in the corner. Double pendulum hits him. Jumping around right now, both trying to just get there. Ooh, nice 10 right. Yes. Combo right there. Okay, gets, gets a lucky RNG off of the ball. But here we go. Items out in effect. The next item will be uh, a dizzy item. So, yeah. Oh, here we go. Yes. And that's oh, okay. Nice block, nice block right there. That could have been that could have been the game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Oh, nice very dark, nice dark force. force. Yeah, good stuff. Illuminati. Also, good block from Kajak on that side switch from it. Yeah, if Illuminati can get this bat down, they'll have all the meter they need to get that second bat. You know, yes. lay lay. Oh, there it is. There it is. Anybody's game now, really. Oh, gets a corner. Nice. Here we go. Is this it? Knockdown. Bubble again. Bubble again. Yes. Of course, yep. Oh, but Lele, yeah, Dark Lele Force. has that super armored Dark Force. Oh, no. Get the oh, no. Oh, my gosh. The armor game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, both of them. Yeah, both of their Dark Forces have super armor. So, yeah, they were just going at it to each other. But that Ooh. is a crazy way to finish that game. But good stuff to K-Jock. That was risky. That yeah. was very risky. Yeah. I mean, you know, made some executive decisions and it worked out. Oh, no. Just having a slight health lead really came in. But, yeah, I mean, Luminati, like, you know, like I was saying, you know, fish with meter. That's easy, yeah. easy. You, know, you can never count them out. That was very close to just one of those full rounds of fish. Yeah, just uh, didn't do the meaty on the wake up, so gave K Jock a time to just activate Dark Horse and get out of that situation. K Jock is just killing these and Rihogs right now. Oh, yeah, so good. Getting and all the damage you can. Oh, nice. All right. oh yeah, yeah. Nice, and nice, grab. yeah. Can you that right there? My pendulum switch way. All right, so pretty even, but Illuminati does have a lot of meter. And I mean, double trade with the pendulum and the double pursuit. It's all it takes sometimes. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice block. All right, yeah. And then K-Shock, yeah, totally content to use the pendulum. Oh, OK, oh. almost has a full combo there, but still in it. Lots of white life on Illuminati's side. Oh, gets hit by the sword. This is bad, and that'll do it. It looks like he just tried to block the first one and thought he would immediately be able to hit a button, but mm -hmm. hit it a little too early and got clipped by the rest. But and yeah. K-Jock is swinging. It's K-Jock time. <laughs> yeah, for sure, for sure. He's definitely feeling himself when he just starts pendulum swinging as much as he can, and he feels real comfortable. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, but it looks like he will be staying on. Uh, oh, oh, man. No. <laughs> now, just uh, lo love to see, you know, <laughs> one of the characters of this scene, right? Oh, and it's actually Kajok versus Minimal. We're up to this point in the bracket oh, already. 
okay, all right. So K Jock and Mini Ma. Uh, this is a qualifying match, so both uh, both of these players will be qualifying out of pools. It'll just be on um, different sides of the bracket, right? Oh, nice. Okay, cool. I didn't even know that we were that far already. Good yeah, stuff. I mean, it's Vampire Savior. Yep. You know, this this game runs fast. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so both of these players um, have played quite a bit, you know. Um, we're going to be seeing Wolf again from Mini Mall, yep. and yeah, Re Lele will be making a return. And what what do you think about this matchup? How do you feel about this matchup? Uh, I mean, I feel like Wolf, of course, has the advantage in it. Mm -hmm. I think just uh, being able to do those air to airs way way faster than Lele. But mm -hmm. if the Lele can take the trades with the Pendulum and at least get some knockdowns and start her own mix ups, mm -hmm. that's really when she can get the momentum. But if if your Wolf just prevent it as much as possible. Yeah, yeah, you can't get hit by Ten Raiha. Yep. Oh no. Yeah. In, good part about Wolf is at least you can roll forward and, and get a little bit more out of it than most characters because of how fast the roll is, but you still take a lot of damage and still have to eat another mix-up if they read that roll. So. Yeah, yeah. I mean, every time I try to roll forward, I just get the bad RNG and I like eat all the balls. <laughs> you know, so I'm like, man. Um, but yeah, definitely um, a harder matchup for Lele. Yes. Um, but I mean, k -Jock is no stranger to playing against Wolf. So yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah, 6 MP start. Uh, that's it's one of the best starters I did. Knocks a whole bunch of stuff out there. And already, first 10 right now, out the gate. Very nice Jirashi on the Oki. Oh, nice. Just poking out with the kick right now. Airborne in on ground. Oh, Ooh, the suck oh, it from the tech the hit. the forbidden tech hit. Oh, no. Never tech hit a cross up. Oh, great. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yo, mini not starting off strong. Good nice block. block. Oh, nice. Command grab, yeah, on that come down. Oh, oh wait, like again. again. Roll it. Oh, I was like, if he rolls into him again. And we were seeing that last night from Ethan, just doing command grab after command grab after command grab. And then he has nailed down his meaties every time. He hit every roll. You got to be super careful against E because he will command grab you the minute you get up. Exactly, exactly. So, yeah, good stuff. Minima taking that really quickly, but k -Doc is not out of it yet. Let's see what kind of adjustments we're going to see from k -Doc side. Yeah, just don't let him get the momentum pretty much. That's what k -Doc needs to do here. All right. Oh, oh but no. in the corner right now. As I say it. Oh, oh nice. Crouch wow. figures. Quick that from Minima. Okay. Oh, only one hit, so not too much damage. Oh, oh no. Ready for that command grab. Oh, nice. 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 Out of nice. Cannon. All right. Oh, okay. I, I like that pursuit. Yeah, Good get block. that corner from all the way across the screen. And Raiha, of course, uh, overhead if she hits you on the top, and then if she hits the ground first, it's a low. It's a low, yeah. <laughs> the best super in the game. Oh, by yeah. far. By far. Yeah, there, there's no doubt. Easily. That's why we're seeing it. That was four times in a row there, but nice from k there you go. Get the momentum right in his favor. It. Right back in it. Oh, nice hide and throw. Yeah, that's the thing, yeah. You know, it is a harder matchup for Lele, but man, both of these characters have low life. So she's a glass cannon, right? Like, yeah, she takes some damage, but man, can she dish it out. Yes. As we're seeing here right now. Oh, oh no. no. Nice pick up. Is that going to do it? Yes, mini maw. Wow. Speaking of glass cannon, I totally didn't think yeah. that was going to kill it. He's like, you got a glass cannon, <laughs> I got a beast cannon. Oh. Let's go. But one of the big things in that matchup that K-Jack was telling me, that is uh, rough for <laughs> Lele. Oh my gosh, point at the camera. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, he knows, yeah. Shout outs to the Wolf Pack. Shout outs to the Wolf Pack. So you said he's out in winners now, I believe. Uh, yeah, yeah. If I'm reading the bracket right, yeah. So both of those players will be qualifying into top 24 later on. Awesome. Um, yeah, just on uh, different sides of the bracket. So yeah, good there stuff. Yeah. Good stuff, Mini Ma. <laughs> Doing it for the Wolf Pack. But a big, a big thing with Lele versus Wolf is uh, if Lele throws an item, uh, Wolf can just beast cannon that immediately. Yeah, yeah if she throws that high item, um, you know, because Wolf is always jumping around, right? So that high item is good at tagging, uh, you know, jumpy wolves. Oh, whoa, Jacko. Um, but yeah, you if she tosses it high, you can just beast cannon straight. And man, if you get that full ES beast cannon, oh, shout, yeah, there's the artwork uh, there from is. Dreamin. Yeah, really awesome. Oops. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, Typhus, um, you can see a, a lot of the community signature are over there around the border. Um, so, yeah, it, it was a really awesome project. Uh, oh, Typhus is right here up on screen, yeah. There we go, Typhus versus Dyer, of course. Yeah, uh -huh. and it's uh, kind of like a, a throwback to a, a previous project by uh, Kyle W., uh, who we'll be seeing later in um, a later pool. Of course. 
who uh, did a similar project, commissioned an artist, got some really dope artwork, and uh, that one was like a kind of a cross-community kind of thing between the U.S. and the JP scenes. And again, got all of our signatures on it, and man, it, it was a really, it was an really awesome thing. You love to see yes. it. You love to see it. Yeah, especially this community is, it, it's great. Seeing mm -hmm. all this stuff being made. I mean, this has, this has so many signatures on it that uh, Typhus has been collecting. It is, it, it's really dope. It's really yeah, just something yeah. cool that you can get just for participating. Exactly, exactly. So um, again, I believe this is a qualifying match. Uh, yes. Yeah, Dyer and Typhus. Um, yeah. Uh, w my projections, it's pretty much these top four uh, yeah. <laughs> in the qualifying <laughs> matches on the winner's side. I think you pretty much nailed that one down. Mm -hmm. but yeah, yeah. But of course, I actually don't think I have seen these two play in a long, long time. Yeah, I can't recall this player matchup um, per se. Um, but yeah, uh, there's plenty of cats over there in SoCal. Not too many Lilith. Oh, yo. Okay, nice. we got the head patch. There you go. Good. Oh, oh no. no confirm. Good punish. Oh, wow. Just a little too Almost. far. Almost. Yeah, a little bit too far. And that's one of the things. It is distance dependent. So, so it's not like a 100% confirm. But yeah, Dire is definitely no stranger to like, yeah, gets the ally out. Whether it hits or whether it misses, she's still in there, right? Yep. Lilith is still in your face. That move has no whip. <laughs> yeah, like see, right exactly, there. Right Ooh. there, right there, yeah. I'm glad that they're listening to us right now. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it some cues from the commentators, right? Yeah. Oh, but nice. Trade with the bar gets the bat. Yeah, so we're even up right here on bat. Even on meter. Anybody's game right now. Ooh, good tech hits. Oh, okay. Ty just fighting his way out of the corner, but the DP keeps him in there. Ty Hawk, that's how you have to check the animals to your DP character mm -hmm. every time. Make sure they don't get those short hops for free. Yeah. Ooh, big dash, but nice. Actually, DP's through the OS. Yeah, and Tyth is just not able. Oh, right as oh. I say that, finally gets out. Big ESDP. Oh, oh no, the trade. The trade. And yes. ES Fireball is so. Oh, we got the. Yeah, shout out to Kyle W. Um, That's a. The, where she just kind of faints away after she wins. Uh, that's like a, I think like a 1 in 128 chance in the normal game. Yes. Uh, but this is a, a aesthetic mod edition um, where you can see that a little bit more often. But back to the gameplay over here. Let's see what kind of uh, adjustments we'll see from Typhus um, to try to, yeah, tie this up. Yeah, he's trying to slow it down a lot right now just to try to see how he can read Jai and Dire to see how he's moving, where he wants to interrupt. But Right now, not looking too good in the corner, but nice OS got the cross up underneath. Knockdown. Yes. Going back in. Nice DC going back. Dyer applying more pressure in the corner here. Good blocks. Good tech. And gets. Wow, that was, that was pretty much punishes in there. Good stuff. Yeah, nice LI from Dyer. Yes. All right, good air throw, but even better tech. And yeah, it was looking good for Typhus, but Dyer is right out of the corner again. Back to neutral zone. All it takes is a few fireballs bopping into you, and you're in that corner. Mm -hmm. oh, but here we go, pushing himself in. Look at that. That is what we were talking about earlier. You have to tech that to get out of that ball trap. Yes. And oh, takes advantage of the spin. Probably not what Dyer wanted. You see? Oh, no. Oh, Ooh, cross up on the okay. second hit. Cross under, very good. Yes. is fighting for his life right now. It's a fireball, though. Oh, no. Oh, try to go for it again. One of those things that got me real. Oh. Ooh, nicely done. Dyer will be qualifying on the winner's side. That is one of those. Lilith has that ES fireball in the corner where if you trade with her, you are about to take even more damage than you yep. would have at all. Just exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because she could get a full combo. She recovers faster and gets a full combo. Sometimes you can combo right into LI. And yeah, good stuff, Dyer. Yeah, good stuff. And yeah. back, to <laughs> yeah, back, back to, you know, back to the... <laughs> back to the zoo. <laughs> yeah, back to the zoo, you know. The match in product. Oh, is that, <laughs> is that fuzzy? Is that fuzzy? Oh, man. Um, but yeah, shout out. Oh. Is that we got cost? Oh, is that Madam Tengu in the Morgan cosplay? Oh, there oh, we go. Oh, there we go. We got the green screen. Yeah, <laughs> the Literally. green screen on the green screen. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, all that. Uh, uh, is that? Oh, yeah, okay, so that is a pools match right there. Yeah, it looks um, like Felicia versus Felicia right now, of mm -hmm. course. Yep, yep, that's uh, Midi on the left. Fish and Felicia definitely showing up now post pandemic. Mm -hmm. So many new players starting oh, with those yeah, characters. Yeah. And it uh, looks like up on stream we have uh, Mop over here. And I'm uh, not sure who their opponent is. Um, but oh, yeah, shout out to Sketch over there. You can see him with the bracket. Um, a New York B player, or actually a world B player. 
uh, Sketch. Uh, I, I just learned uh, this weekend that Sketch uh, was over here, uh, or not over here, in the Midwest, over in Cincinnati for a while. Yes, yes. Yeah. He uh, he was a Cincinnati. He's one of the. He is also one of the original VMPs, essentially. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. uh, you know, he's been. He, he is the world traveler. Yeah. <laughs> he's the world yeah. warrior. Australia, Japan, yo, know, every been everywhere. But here we go. We got Mop versus Luminati. So is this? This will be this Felicia. Be a Felicia mirror. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. <laughs> not a fish mirror. Uh huh. Felicia. Yeah. Yeah. Not a fish mirror. <laughs> Felicia. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, we on Paw Patrol over here. Oh jeez. Yeah. So um, it'll be interesting. I think both of them kind of played a try to play like a more laid back style, not too in your face, more of kind of a neutral base using. Felicia strong pokes and stuff, um, but weren't able to get their games off uh, in their their winners side games. Yeah, they had some tough competition that they had to Whew. go up against. So yeah, they sure did. I mean, yeah, yeah, ain't, ain't no stranger, you know, to losing to the folks that they lost to. So you know, definitely, it'll be good to see uh, which one of them. Actually, how far are we? I'm not sure if if this is a qualifying match or not. I don't think we're don't quite think so, there. Yet. Yeah, we're pretty close, but right now. Of course, we're running this tournament on Mister. You know, people are still getting used to it, but it has mm -hmm. been so good. Tur Mister oh, has man. made everything so much I, easier. I need to get myself a Mister, man. Oh, uh, they are uh, amazing. Yeah, I'm right behind you. I'm still waiting for a pre-order right now. To be oh, honest. nice, nice, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, yo, can't take my shirt off on stream, yeah. You a shock. I believe, yeah, I believe Luminati always brings out the H and K whenever he gets on stream. Awesome, I I enjoy the hell out of that game. Oh, that game is awesome, man. I, I ran uh, a tournament there over at uh, Anime Evo a while back, and man, it was it was so cool. Like they had uh, some of the JP players over there. Man, great game, great game. But uh, back to this great game over here. We got Luminati and my Luminati playing Fish. Fish, Felicia, my bad. Oh, okay, wait, wait. Okay, yeah. So we're we're all mixed up yep. over here, but it's all good, you know. <laughs> It's all good. Too many Fish and Felicia players. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice activation nice. with the Dark Force. Oh, oh that's a lot damage. of damage. Oh my god, so much damage, and here we go. Oh my gosh, I didn't even need to use the ES Sonic Spin. That's a good answer to that too as well. Hit the chunks off that damage. Yeah, and that's, that's one of the few downsides about those super armor ones that, like, you know, since it's all super armor, you don't get combos. So if you do a combo against them, it's all unscaled damage. So you can get a lot of damage on against those characters. Yes, especially if you get, like, a dragon cannon from Yeah, the a. cinnamon twist. Oh, so, man, yep. Yeah. That whole health bar is gone. Nice. Using Dark Force to try to defensively get out here, but... Jabs out. Okay, yeah. Keeps it safe with activation. Oh, there's always bubble? one more sweep. Oh, oh, okay. oh yeah. Okay, very nice, very nice. Just a little too long. Felicia has one of the longest get-ups, so yeah, it's like yeah. you gotta learn specific timings for her, especially with the bubbles. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But nice ES pursuit. All right, looking good. Poked out. Oh, oh okay. Does it count to the sweep? But gets Shit. the bat though. So yeah. Oh, and that's what we were talking about. One way to escape the bubble. Yeah, just wall clean and jump out out of there. Yep. Oh, nice. Trying to apply pressure, get himself out of the corner here, throwing yeah. out the gas. Not over for Hold Luminati. Throw. Okay, throws out the bubble and Nietzsche. Oh, Ooh, that was almost there. Oh, nice. wow. So close. So hard still, to keep this still cat down. Still not over yet. Still not over yet. All it takes is one. He's got two meter. If he yep. gets one knockdown, this could pretty much be it. Oh, okay, no. Okay, a little bit too far, but yep. go. okay, nice. Five LP anti air. Okay, uses the rings to go in there. Ooh, oh, uses both. Buttons. Yeah. Probably really looked at the time and was like, oh shoot, I gotta start making some moves right now. About oh, meter. Look, it's, oh, bubble, what's it gonna be? There it is. What a comeback from Luminati. Wow, good stuff. Came all the way back with no help that yeah, whole time. Yeah, good stuff. yeah. Very nice. You know, did it, you know, didn't stress out too much. You know, just was like, okay, these are the things I need to do. Yep, this is how I may really use bubble as kind of a not only as like a way to, you know, try to get that combo and make up that damage, but as a pressure tool. Too. And to make, you know, MOP, just kind of, you know, stress out like, ah, oh, what do I do? You know, okay, I have to walk clean and get out. But, yep. you know, kind of put himself in a bad situation there, too. And, so. of course, if he just, if you choose the same option every time, he's going to catch on. And mm -hmm. that's what mm -hmm. Lumen and I definitely sniped a few there. Definitely. But, yeah, here we go again. Um, yeah, Mop looking good at the beginning here once again. Oh, nice back throw so into yeah. the corner. Okay, doesn't get the toy touch, but still in the corner. Okay, nice tech. tech. Really needed that to keep that bat. Yes. Let's see, just trying to throw out some gas just to see if he can catch an opening real quick. Of course, you gotta be very careful if you're moving around, just hitting buttons against fish in one of those gases on the screen. It has a long hitbox. Mm -hmm. Nice throw, right. anti-air. Nice anti-air, and the overhead will take it. Ooh, nice side switch over there. 
Such a good quick way to finish at that is that dashing MK real quick. Ooh. Oh, oh, didn't actually finish. Probably wasn't prepared to actually get yeah, the Sonic yeah, spin out yeah. like that. Uh oh. Oh, wow. Sonic Bubble, Spear. And this is going to be. Oh, okay. Gets that trade, and then Mop will take that one. Yeah, yeah. still alive. Yeah, and it's so important. Like, when you're at that last bit of health on your first bat, keeping that is so good. Because oh. oh, big jump back, and you even got the combo yeah, for it. Really nice. Of course, like we were saying, the bubble disappears the minute fish gets touched. If you can hit him, you're good. That's how every bubble in the game works, sadly. <laughs> All right, here we go. But Getting that pressure. And then this is a similar situation yep. as we saw last game, right? A lot Luminati of meter fish. down on health, but got some meter. You know, Mop, oh, lots of meter himself. Oh, but there we go. Seals the deal this time. So we're tied up 1-1. One, one. Yep, didn't have enough health to take that hit in the Dark Force. So mm -hmm. sadly, sorry, fish. But yeah, 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 one one, but good stuff to Luminati still staying in there right now. Yeah, Luminati and Mop, yeah, looking really good, going back and forth between each other. So, yeah, we're well, it's gonna see. Yeah, this is it. And this is the one. You gotta qualify out of this, or you're going home. <laughs> oh yeah, all, already in the losers bracket here. We've already had our winners. Uh, it is Dire yes. and Mini Maw going on. So, mm -hmm. nice knockdown. Yes, toy touch. All right. Ooh, misses the media a little okay, bit. Yeah. yeah, fish gets up kind of fast after the roll. So yeah, gotta be gotta be quick on the draw on those. Nice for going back oh, in. Oh nice, yeah. Catches the wall cling. Oh here we go, dark force time. Oh no. Oh, oh. nice text from Duminati, yeah. Nice and uses a little bit early of deactivation, just throw him off his timing to try to punish it, but good mm -hmm. stuff. But very even right now. Fish is with a little bit extra meter. Oh the, the dark go. the legal tech hit. Alright, okay, and then first bat will go to Mop. Uh, let's see if Illuminata can bring it right back and make it even once again. Oh, here we go. This could be it. Bubble. Oh, nice. Oh, there we go. Played very patient this time. Didn't throw out any buttons to trade with. Smart stuff. Mm -hmm. Just let Mop do everything for you, you know. That's how Ooh, it goes sometimes. I really like that jump in right there. Oh, okay, I like that. Yeah, I'm trying to learn some fish myself, so definitely uh, taking some notes over here. Pulling out the seashell. Yeah, <laughs> man, the conch, man. Oh, that jump, jump MP, man. Oh, nice Ooh, okay. jump out. Using that wall cling, get out of that bubble setup. Oh, but this oh, is a big knockdown. Oh, big knockdown right here. Can we get out? Yes, yep. we can. Such last minute. You gotta, as a fish player, you oh. gotta pretty much watch for that and snipe him. I, I love that rainbow roll just to get out of that pressure situation. You know, recognize I cannot be here in the corner versus fish. I gotta get out. Oh, oh no, wow. gets gassed. Gets gassed in the air. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, nice oh, unblockable. Nice guard break. Oh, okay, Ooh, no, no punish. punish. There. And all it takes is really one knockdown for fish into a bubble setup, and that could be it. Yeah. Oh, oh neutral bubble. bubble. There we go. What's it going to be? A little too far into the corner. Mm -hmm. Time is ticking down, so yeah. Mop needs to make some moves to tie up this differential right here. Okay, yeah. A little too, little too cheeky with that bubble, but it's all good. Here Trying to go control nice neutral a little, but not, a, not the best option for mm -hmm. sure, but nice. All right, Dark Force. Oh, here we go. Ooh, oh, no. Okay. Ooh. All right, he activates, but yeah, you gotta gotta do something. And oh, then, no. Yeah, Illuminati knows it, and it's just going in with the buttons. Yep. So use that Dark Force as, if you have enough life, that's when you get to just play around with that and go nuts. Like mm -hmm. we were seeing with Lele and uh, Fish earlier. They both yeah, just yeah. went at each other with the Hyper Armor to see who had more. It's so fast, that Dark Force. That crap. Oh, man, it's so fast. And it's one of those that's so hard to punish. It's like, it's got a little bit of a punish, apparently, mm -hmm. but... It's just, it, it feels impossible. Oh, yeah, for sure, for sure. Um, but, yeah, good stuff to Illuminati. We'll be moving on. Um, GG's to Mop. Uh, nice to see you out here. Uh, Mop, uh, one of the players I've seen a lot, playing a lot more online uh, on Ficade and stuff, and uh, it's nice to put a face to the name. Yeah, yeah, it's because, every like I said, everyone's coming out today, especially mm -hmm. everyone that's been grinding online during this pandemic. Oh. Okay. Oh, so that was a qualifying match. So yeah, L Illuminati will be qualifying out in losers. So good stuff. Nice, good stuff to Illuminati. Mm -hmm. Now we got Miller Two B coming up. Um, oh, no, I believe that's a. Uh, uh, is that Shaq? Yeah, I think I want to say that. Man. All right, cool. Yeah. So Shaq. Oh, wearing the old school uh, vampire savior shirt uh, that uh, one of our players, uh, Zano Sichimonji. Uh, she she made those shirts. Yes. And uh, oh man, that was a long time ago now. Yeah. But it's a really sick design. Uh, yeah, definitely cool stuff. She's actually out here today too as well. And she is, uh, I believe, in one of the later pools today. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Another fish player. Yep. <laughs> um, a pad fish player at that. Really interesting. You don't yes. see a lot of pad players in this game. And she plays in such a unique way that it's just like it's real hard to keep her down. Honestly. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice big jump in. Oh, that's right. Yeah, Shaq plays Black Squash. 
Nice. All right, jumps Keeps over jumping. the cast, gets in there. Forward throw. Oh, nice. Pokes him out of the yeah. gas, but... And then Shaq is just uh, winning these kind of uh, scramble situations there, getting the full combo. Oh, oh nice. wow! That might have been a guard cancel, but yeah, got the raw one anyway. Out. Yeah, yep. and that does so much damage. It's oh. just one hit. So yeah. That does a lot of damage right there. Uh-oh, oh, gets the gas. the gas. Here you go. This is Miller's chance to get the bat. Miller's trying to apply more pressure. Has two bars right now to play around with. All right, yeah. A couple... I, Miller is expecting the dash in to come, so it's just charging back. And Hitting that ES gas, yep. Mm -hmm. ES gas filling up the whole screen immediately. Yeah, yeah so. definitely. You can't push any buttons against that. Yeah. Oh, but apply right. more pressure. Nice Ooh, DC. There's the guard cancel again. Finish that bat off. Oh no, try to do it again. Getting <laughs> yeah. a little crazy, but hey, you know, I like it. All right. Oh, oh nice. and there we go. Yeah. And that's what's so um, good with fish in this matchup, you know. Oh, here we go. That was a great Bloop. bubble chase down. Okay, nice. Yeah. Oh! Oh what? no, he jumped. He jumped so he lost the super armor. Oh. If you jump our dash, you lose the super armor and you can be juggled like normal. Word. Yes, yeah, oh. so if you hit a beast cannon on a Sasquatch that's dashing, you can actually punish can them punch. again from the Dark Force. Yeah. Oh, I see. today I learned. Yep, All it, right, it is. Make sure that you are not doing back dash or forward dash with Sasquatch after you activate to pop that bubble. It will okay. catch you every time. Okay, well, yeah, good stuff. Uh, Miller taking full advantage of that. Still even up. Uh oh, here comes Shag in the corner. Miller, very nice command throw. Okay, Ooh, Baja blasting it out. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Okay, nice, nice throw. throw back in there. Oh, Ooh, that was so close. The confirmed. All it took was that one sweep, it could have been it. But yeah, just... Miller's still alive. Okay, trying to build some space right now. Miller's going in. Okay, taking it slow, Got waiting it. for the down. Oh, that's there over the ice. And Miller takes that one. Woo. I was just about to say, Miller just has to play very patiently and not throw out any two crazy Sonic Spears because mm -hmm. that ice castle, he's been waiting so long. Yeah, he sniped him yeah. a couple of times, but... Good stuff to Miller to watch that and just play it slow and catch that ice tire and get the huge punish. Yeah, definitely a tense situations, but yeah, cool under pressure is that fish player. So yeah, very nice. Um, but you know, Sasquatch is a pretty cool thing, you know, especially with that ice tower, such a great move. Um, you know, when fish is trying to do get too much, you know, going with the projectile game, that ice tower can catch him slipping. Yep, and just he does so much damage just off your basic mm -hmm. chain combos, you know. And that's get that basic mix, get the chain and you're good. Oh, nice. rolls forward into it. Oh, knockdown. Yeah, another bubble. That okay. Oh, nice jump. Oh, oh no, no, text right into it. Good I spoke stuff too early. To Miller. Let's see, all oh, catching with the Sonic Spear for the dash. All right. And yeah, just keeping Shag in the corner. Oh, oh jumps no. into it. No, big knockdown. Yeah, Doesn't have enough no for another meter. bubble. All right, Shag. Oh, there it is. There it <laughs> oh, is. No. Trapped him in the corner. Oh, misses oh, okay. sweet though. Nice. But it's out. Okay, Shag is still in this. Oh no, again misses the full confirm into sweet. Yeah, just might want to go straight into the sweet from that far, just to make sure that he can get at least the knockdown. You know, Do, don't you don't need optimal damage every time. Yeah. Oh. oh, yo, try to put the puddle out there. Oh, nothing. Okay, Baja blasting. Just throw a little bit of that chip. It's, it's such a good tool, especially to catch the the animals dashing. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, they always sure, want to. Sure. Oh, and with there the you trade. go with the trade. Miller 2B will be advancing. So good stuff. Uh, Shag, yeah, uh, one of the longtime players, I believe, has been playing for years. Um, before before I, I came into the scene, I know they definitely been wow. playing. So, yeah, good stuff. Um, yeah, lo love to see him come out. Always coming out to, uh, especially the East Coast events. Um, yeah, always, always start supporting Vampire Savior. So. <laughs> We got Gourmet Sketch back there in the background waving. Uh huh. What's up, Sketch? <laughs> Hello, Sketch. Well, this is the last match of the pool. Awesome. And uh, so far, we've had on the winner's side, we have uh, Dyer and Mini Maw. Mm -hmm. On the loser's side, we have K Jock. We have uh, Luminati. Luminati. Going yeah. on the loser's side. And Typhus on the loser's Typhus, side as well yes, right yes. now. So, this will be the last match for the last decision of it. Yeah, so good stuff. Um, so. Uh, Miller versus, um, uh, it was, uh, Midi. Midi. Felicia, yeah. yeah, Midi. And the winner of this will be going on on the loser side, so this is, this is the last match of the pool, this mm -hmm. is it. Yeah. <laughs> so fast. Oh, catches the deactivation, all right, it's bubble trouble time. Nice, trades with the air to air, trying to keep Felicia in this corner. All right, Ooh. oh, rules for it, okay, but gets out, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's going to use that fast back right dash, there, yeah. Miller gets the bat, though. Miller's starting off strong right now. Midi with no bar, so no dark force to get out of uh, command grab setup right now. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Jumps over. Oh, oh, ju oh just a deactivate that Dark Horse. Trying to make something happen over here. Yeah. yeah. Get rid of that bat, right? That's a party starter, you know? <laughs> Every Felicia loves to just activate that full screen and see <laughs> yeah, what they can do. Oh, no. Oh, big oh, damage in the bubble. bubble. again. Going to get the meaty. Yes, yep. we are, and that'll do it. Nice. Miller taking that first game solidly. Yeah, very convincing. You know, uh, playing it patient. Just uh, been really good at the bubbles in neutral. Yes. He he just throws them out there, and everyone seems to just fall right into him no matter mm -hmm. what. I, I'm a huge victim of those. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. For sure, for sure. Um, yeah, and, you know, it's just such a scary move, and it controls so much space. It moves so slowly. Like, yeah, it's definitely a really strong tool if you can get it out there. And every time you think it's about to pop, it just lasts a little bit yeah, longer. Yeah, just a little bit, right? Oh, nice tech from that air throw. That is such a such funny air throw from Fish that immediately has you tech and hit the oh, ground. Oh, yeah, he tech just, it. like, tosses you real quick, right? Yes, and uh, Wolf can actually punish that, but oh, oh really? nice into the overhead. Oh, no. Oh, Ooh, nice air Oh, very air. nice, and into the command grab. First bat down. Okay, yeah. Swatted that bubble. Oh, oh it goes, goes under, under the rings. Very nice from Midi. Very smart move. Oh, nice. Now oh, Midi in the corner okay. pressure, but... And again, yeah, not comboing directly into sweep. Uh, yep. It's costing. Oh, Just, oh yeah, oh, it's going to no. go right. Oh, oh misses it misses slightly. It, yeah. <laughs> that can happen. Oh, oh, no. Right into it, and this yep. could do it. Knockdown. Boom. There we go. Miller 2B will be qualifying for top 24 on loser's side. Full G today. That will be, like I was saying, that will be Cage, or that will be Mini Maw in winners, Dire in winners, and then losers. We got Typhus, we got Kajak, we got Miller 2B, and we got Luminati going in on top 24. Yeah, so really good stuff to all of our players here. Yes. Man, it's just I, so many good players in that pool, right? Yes, and it is. I mean, this whole tournament is just so yeah. stacked. Yeah, I mean, all the pools are going to be like this. Yeah. All the players, all the pools. Yeah. Make sure that you guys stay tuned and watch that. We're going to be switching out to another pool here in a bit here at Combo Breaker 2022. I'm so glad to be back. Definitely. And yeah. Actually, you'll, you'll be seeing us. Uh, we'll be actually yes. in the same pool. You yep. might be playing against <laughs> each other, actually, you know, if we both uh, win our first matches. So, yeah, of definitely catch, uh, catch the Wolf Pack. You'll see some <laughs> more of us, you know, on the other side of the screen. Yep. Um, but, yeah, thank you all for joining us and uh, get ready for some more Vampire Savior. It'll be a little bit, you know, Vampire Savior runs really fast, so uh, yeah. Only I'm took half the block today, so yeah, yeah. You know, again, like like we said before, you know, it's a fast game, fast and fierce, yep. lots of pressure, lots of offense, and lots of fun. Exactly, and it is the time saver. And if you're interested in anything that you've seen today, of course, one of our community leaders sitting right here. We got Hagare, of course. Go follow him. We have Kyle W here who set up the mod. He's the one who made it and everything. And then of all the at Vampire Acadia team, we have uh, Abby. Zach, Leah, Mini Ma, everybody. Mm -hmm. But yeah. checking out the Mizumi, of course, that is a huge help. And just maybe getting on the fight cade. We're going to have Capcom Fighting Collection coming out soon yeah, as well. Yeah. So it'll be, there's going to be lots of ways to play this game soon. For sure, for sure. Yeah, and definitely, yeah. If you do want to learn more about the game, uh, you can always join the Vampire Savior Discord. I'm sure somebody in the chat will post a link for y'all. Um, yeah, and uh, it's, it's a wonderful community. Uh, it's been really nice to find folks you know of course the game is fun yes but what, what i really come out here for is the people you know I, I just love the community everybody's so helpful um in the discord we try to help all all the new folks as best we can and uh yeah it's super awesome so yeah thank you all again yes um again yeah this is hagare uh go ahead follow me and this is tank top typhoon everybody i don't have twitter anymore but <laughs> so follow me if you want yeah yeah <laughs> but yeah man uh till the till we see you on the other side yep. Yeah. Keep it locked over here. Peace out, everybody. Peace out, y'all. You see what y'all did? You don't like ads? This is what you get. So let's run those right now. Let's take a break. When we return, more Combo Breaker 2022 coming at you. Schoolgirls Mobile is free right now on the Apple Store and Google Play. Go ahead and download it today and get a free gift. Let's go, Samson! Oh, sure. 
Master the game. Go to metafy.gg right now and use the code COMBO20 to get 20% off and get good. The Hitbox Arcade controllers are designed with precision, accuracy, and speed. Take control today at hitboxarcade.com slash CB2022. Kwamba has all of your tournament essentials on the lock. You can use the code COMBOBREAKER2022 to get 20% off at their website, kwambausa.com. Paradise Arcade Shop is teaming up with Combo Breaker to give y'all a limited edition impress exclusive to Combo Breaker. guilty picking up this officially licensed merch from the fine folks at 10 go visit 10 o.gg slash merch to pre-order now no coasts no kings only fits and things visit combobreaker.org slash shop to get your 2022 combo breaker merch Counts literally every single time on it, it all happens. Oh! 